in the four years and a half that you have been a real estate investor, how many people have you helped that Monday before oh the auction? Um, I would say we, we, we buy houses in a variety of different ways, um, but foreclosures is one of those. And I, I would say that it's probably nine or 10 of the homes that we have uh, purchased have been through stopping the foreclosure. Um, and, and we're still in contact, believe yeah. it or not, with some of those owners that we bought homes from because they're, because they're so grateful they, yeah, yeah because they know they wait for the last minute they and it's not their fault because they're like a lot of them they don't know what's next they don't want to let the house go to the bank again right they don't have much <clears throat> option and that's when we come in and give them a better alternative than losing everything to the bank because the bank does not help the homeowners much at all unfortunately no, the, the bank is a lending institution. Yeah. That's their core business. They're not interested in helping people. They have shareholders yeah. that they have to satisfy. And if it requires getting rid of bad debt, yeah. then that's what they do. That is what they They have to do it to keep up as a banker. Right. And I understand that, but I'm glad that we're here and helping homeowners in every single direction, trying to stop them losing their house on the auction. Sure. So. Uh, so the challenge that I would think on this one was to be able to stop the foreclosure the day before auction. That's correct. Yeah. Because now <clears throat> you were just beginning as a real estate investor back then. How did you learn? Because I know today how to stop a foreclosure before, mm -hmm. before one day before auction. But I did not know that then. How did you learn that? Well, the... <laughs> Um, talk about jumping into the deep end. Uh, that's what we did on this one. And uh, we really had no idea. We knew that it was possible to do. Uh, we knew that um, taking a home sub to the existing mortgage was possible, uh, but we didn't have the, the real life experience. Uh, we had the theoretical experience. So um, we did what, what we could do up to a certain level and then we called our lifeline. That's our authority. lifeline. Yeah. Yes, you know, who is your online? Did you call Phil and Shanoa? I called Shanoa, yes. And uh, and she walked us through step by step what to do. Um, and it was very clear, very concise, uh, and obviously very successful. And I think when we do have a power team, a, a, a inner circle that gives us all the answers that they already been through, it makes our life so much easier and how to be successful much faster. Sure. And I think that's what we have. Um, for people who doesn't know who is Phil and Chano, they are the founder of, you know, the inner circle who is being investing for over two decades now. And they're not just talking, they are actually acting and doing real estate investment to today. And uh, they have been teaching us and a thousand of other investors over and over and over. and holding people's hand every single day and how to make them successful as well. Yeah, uh, and it works. It um, works. <laughs> yeah, we have now completed over 60 residential real estate transactions in that four years, um, and every single one of them has been successful. How many investor comes into you that is just starting out that wants to partner with you and wants to learn from you? We, we have many. Um, I, I think... Uh, in total, we have you know, over 60 partners and investors um, that we have worked with or, or are still working with. And what's really gratifying is that a, a good number of those investors are people that have just joined the Inner Circle and, uh, and they are looking to us as we looked to other senior members when yeah. we first joined. And uh, you know, the advice uh, that we can give them as a result of the experiences that we've had uh, which is not everything, but it was four and a half years of experience and someone else, another senior uh, member has you know, similar experience or something very different. This, this resource is, is amazing. So we, uh, I would suggest that you know, a lot of the deals that we have at the moment, uh, a lot of our projects, um, at least one of the partners will be a new investor. And we're able to uh, walk them through, even if you know, they're not participating 
um, with sweat equity. You know, they um, are fully able to follow the project through from the very start to the very end, um, you know, and, and ask all of those questions and get that experience from being there.